what's up PM gang welcome or welcome back to my channel it is your girl Pandora Monet <laughs> What's up, PM gang? Your girl is kind of doing too much. I had to put some lotion on y'all because my hands are ashy. But it is Friday. So happy Friday. It's December 1st. So happy December 1st. It's 1.02 in the afternoon. Your girl is... I'm working today in the office, but your girl is on lunch. I'm about to head to Bath and Body Works because they're having a candle sale that's $10 for the um, reward members. They're having it today. And your girl's going to be busy like all set, all weekend anyway. So I wanted to go ahead and get it out the way. So I'm about to go on my lunch break. So hopefully they have like some good picks since it did just start today. Hopefully nobody has went. I think they just opened it like 10 o'clock anyway. 10 or 9 o'clock. I don't know. But your girl is headed to Bath and Body Works. Um, I will be vlogging this weekend. Tomorrow me and my boyfriend is going to a all jean party that my aunt is throwing for her best friend and we're all in like the birthday club or whatever so everybody should be coming so we're going to go there i'll be vlogging and you guys exciting news um so when i get off today my dog my dad is giving me and isaac a bulldog y'all he's so freaking cute he's only four months i think he'll be five months or like a couple of weeks or whatever but he's only four months so y'all i'm so freaking excited y'all i'm so freaking excited we've kind of been back and forth talking about getting a new dog but it wasn't really like like we wasn't really forcing it it was kind of like yeah we want a new dog but we wasn't really about to go out and just purchase one plus we've been going back and forth about what kind of dog that we want and stuff like that so yeah we didn't really get the dog or whatever but my dad recently i think he got the dog like november 21st um and he kind of been going back and forth about keeping it because he has a french bulldog and she's like she's older i think she's like five or something like that but they kind of wasn't getting along in the beginning but then but now they're kind of like warming up to each other but he's a truck driver so he's like he's home every night but like he works all day and he's on the road or whatever so it's like he don't really have time for two dogs um so he kind of didn't want to just give them to anybody so he asked if we wanted him and we and I was just talking about it a little bit and he was kind of like yeah we can just take him because he was kind of like excited about it so if he was excited about it I mean yeah let's go ahead and do it because <laughs> usually he'll just be like nah but since he do have a new job now and he's he literally works from home except for one day out the month or whatever it's kind of like a like the best thing to like get him now because we'll be able to train him we will be able to take him out and all that good stuff plus we want we really want to give louie um give louie a friend y'all he's so lonely he's so annoying so i'm excited to give him a friend so he can leave us alone <laughs> but yeah y'all and right now we're also um dog sitting my bro my boyfriend's brother and his wife and his family they went out of town this weekend so he asked isaac to dog sit and he has two maltese and one of them her name is bella she's like 11 years old she's a sweetheart she's a sweetheart but she has a son named coco and he's like five years old and he's very territorial of her i don't know if i'm saying it right but y'all know what i'm trying to say but he's very like protective over her or whatever and anytime we try to like go near her or whatever he's just not going for it but he's still a sweetheart it's just you know he has to warm up to us because he knows Isaac he just doesn't know me so yeah we've been dealing with that y'all the first night that we brought him home he literally because we let him out the car to use bathroom before we took him into the house and he decided to we didn't have him on a leash we knew we should have put him on a leash but we didn't because his mom did just fine but him he literally ran away from us y'all like he literally ran from us and we had to chase him i stepped in dog poop dog poop and everything y'all like it's been a disaster and they're there until monday so yeah we'll literally have a whole house full of dogs four dogs this weekend until they go home um and then of course we'll have two moving forward but we can deal with two like we realized with keeping three dogs we was like okay two is fine because you know i can walk louie he can walk his name is boogie that's the dog name but we thinking about changing it but yeah he can walk the new dog i can walk louie or whatever and yeah that's that but three dogs or more i'm like yo <laughs> i don't know if i can do it i don't know if i can do it y'all but that is kind of like a little backstory of what 
that's been going on in my life this past week um it's been a crazy 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 time and i'm really just ready to get over it but we're about to have a good time this weekend y'all like i said we're going to my um my one to the birthday party or whatever sunday i don't really think we're doing anything honestly probably just you know working with the dog trying to get him and louie to be friends be best buds or whatever and that's about it y'all i don't i don't think we're gonna be doing anything um so yeah i'm about to go into bath and body works i'm gonna probably try to vlog um on my phone like probably try to get like a few clips or whatever i'm not going to take my camera in there because i already told you guys i'm pressed for time so i want to like kind of be in and out and i'm trying to see if they're packed they don't look like it. oh yeah they're kind of packed so let me see they're kind of packed so yeah i'm just going to try to be in and out in and out that's my goal because like i said i am on lunch and i also still want to see if i can get some food so yeah y'all that is the start of this vlog super excited for this weekend especially to get the new dog because like i said we've been wanting a new dog and a bulldog if you guys know is very very expensive so it's not like a you know cheap little dog bulldogs are almost five to seven thousand probably seven five to ten thousand dollars so i'm grateful thankful that my dad was able to give us that dog and y'all he's so freaking cute i can't wait for you guys to see him i'm gonna show you guys a picture real quick but I can't wait for you guys to see him and meet him because he's just so cute. He has the cutest face. Look at him. He has the cutest face. And one of his eyes is blue. The other one is like a grayish, whitish, y'all. He's so freaking cute. So I can't wait to see him, you guys. But let's go ahead and head into Bath and Body Works and get these candles. As you can see, I'm back in the car. I did not vlog, y'all. It was so freaking packed. People were standing outside in the line. I'm so glad I got there when I got there because if not, I'll still be waiting in line or I will have to leave without anything. But I got the goods. Um. I'm trying to hurry up. I just got some food from Wendy's because that's literally the only place I passed by that was not packed. Um, but I'm about to get ready to head back to work in a little bit because I still have a few more minutes. I kind of left a little late. So, and it's 156 right now. I'm sitting in Target parking lot. But I want to show you guys the candles that I did get. I went in there with the mindset of getting my strawberry pound cake. But she literally said that they had 10 cases of the pound cakes and they all sold out. So, your girl was not able to get any. But I did while I was in the car. Well, while I was standing in line, I was waiting in line online as well. And then when I got in the car, I had I was able to place the order. So I got two strawberry pound cakes online. And I also got the watermelon. I think it's like watermelon lemonade. That one smells so good. So I also got that one as well. So I got three more candles on the way. But while I was in there, I did smell a few that I did like. So I got the snowy peach berry. I got that one, y'all. It smells really good. I've never smelled this one before, but I, it smells really good. And then I got, sorry y'all, they kind of put it in these little things so you can hold them right, but it's hard to get them out. Um, and then I got, kind of this, champagne toast. I've never had the candle, but I've had like the lotion and stuff like that. So this is actually my first time ever getting a candle. But it smells really, really good. If you guys know, champagne toast smells really good. And then, last but not least, like I said, I only got three candles out of there because I kept smelling them, but I didn't really smell anything that I really liked. And like I said, I really went in there for the strawberry pound cake. Um, and then I got the mahogany wood intense. If you guys know this scent, it's a very popular one. Kind of give you like that masculine smell, and it smells really good. I might use that for like our office or like our bedroom. I don't know. My boyfriend, he kind of likes the mas 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 masculine scents. But then again, it's kind of like, you know, but so yeah, those are the three that I got. Like I said, I do have three more on the way. And yeah, that's basically the little um, candle, Bath and Body Works candle haul. And while I'm thinking about it, it's raining right now. It's sprinkling. So I'm about to go ahead and put this in the trunk. So I won't have to worry about it when I get to work. Yeah, so I'm about to set my food up so I can eat on the way back to work. And then, by the time I get to work, I really probably will be done eating, honestly. If not, I'm just going to take it in with me and finish it at my desk. But, see yeah, y'all. So, your girl get off at 5 o'clock today, sadly, because I'm covering up front, like, helping out or whatever. Um, Well, I'm not covering up front, but, like, I had to cover for lunch and I had to stay until 5 today. Um, 
and yeah so that's why i'm getting off at five o'clock today and then like i told you guys as soon as we get off as soon as i get off because my boyfriend working from home today and he get off at like three maybe four um as soon as i get home from work we plan on hitting the road to meet my dad so we can get boogie um like i said that is his name for now my boyfriend claimed he want to change it but he has to like see him first so i don't know we'll see when we get him because i like boogie a little bit i mean it wasn't like my first choice because my dad asked me what name he should name him and i think i said rocky or something like that and he didn't really like that so he said what about boogie and I was like, cool, yeah, that sounds good, but like, it wasn't my dog at the time, it was his dog. So if he wanna name his dog Boogie, he can name his dog Boogie, like, it's not a bad name. I think I might wanna start with an L, like Louie, but I just don't know what. So, I don't know, we'll see. We will see. I got a chicken sandwich. I basically got the biggie bag, I got a chicken sandwich, no cheese, lettuce and tomatoes, and then I got some chicken nuggets in a bag and I also got put some hand sanitizer on even though it's too late and I also got some um fries and a fruit punch even though I don't need it <laughs> I also have water in my cup so oh yeah y'all that is it so I'll talk to you guys when we are headed to get our new puppy What's up, PM gang? My phone. What's up, PM gang? It is 5:26. As you guys know, the girl got off at um, five o'clock, and I just changed my clothes, just threw on something real quick. I don't really care what I got on, but we were about to head out and go pick up our new puppy. Um, I bought Louis this a while back from TJ Maxx. And when I went to TJ Maxx to get the new dog some toys, I found one for him, so they'll be matching. And then I just bought him just a couple of toys. We didn't really need to buy much because my dad bought his bowls. He actually has a two dog leash, so we can walk them both at the same time whenever the time is right. And then he already had two beds. I also already had a bed. Like it's a big gigantic bed. I bought it for Louie, but he don't really sleep on beds because I wanted to buy him one that he can't hump. Because if you have any like squishy soft beds, he'll hump them. So I stopped buying those and I bought this big one, but he don't sleep on it. So I'm gonna just give that to Boogie and yeah. So we're about to head out. We have to get some gas and then we'll be hitting the highway. We're gonna be driving about three hours away, like past Charlotte. I think it's Gastonia, Gastona, however you say it, I don't know. But we're gonna be meeting him there. And we're about to head out. Cause my boyfriend is getting ready now. So I guess I'll talk to you guys when we go pick up the dog. I know two people want him right now. Give me a hug. He like little. He ain't getting fat. He like you know. little. Look at you. Look. Say yeah. hey. Why you so little? Why he's so little? He's a you baby. You said he's fat. No, he's a no, he's a baby. He's so cute. What's going on, boy? Yeah. All right. That's him. That's when he's four months old. He is bathroom. I'm trying to get him. He did one when we stopped about an hour ago. He probably like, what is going on? He probably smells little. I got the little. pads in there too. Y'all need the pads put on the floor, whatever. <laughs> and let him sit on the seats. <laughs> Why? Cause he gonna pee. Oh, boogie. I mean, what's up, June? What my camera look like this? Uh-uh, uh-uh. He's getting it. He's digging it all up, too. And who the hell is this? <laughs> this is going to be so funny. Many were like, what the hell is this? They all the colors looking all... Same height as, um, you're the same height as Minnie now. Oh, he is. Yeah, yeah he's just going to be he's gonna be thick like us. He's going to be thick just like her. Y'all about the same height, yeah? Mm-hmm. Do he, do he like to sleep? Cause he going to sleep. <laughs> I thought this girl, my friend, her sister, she wanted him so bad. I give you, I give you a thousand dollars. Nah, I said my daughter seen him, seen him when she wanted him, so. I what's up pm fam it's literally the next morning and i literally look how i feel don't mind all these pimple patches that's on my face because i'm trying to get my skin right because i have to do my makeup later still have my bonnet on it's only 11:38, and 
it's been a night it's been a night y'all i'm excited i'm excited to have june his name is june we named him june i don't know what his middle name is going to be my cousin said rocky i mean rocco june roberts or like june rocco roberts i don't know but it might just be june because june is kind of like just sticking with us so we might just keep june he's outside right now in the garage my boyfriend is actually working on his bike so yeah y'all the place looks a mess these two over here are in the cage because they don't know how to act louie is upstairs in our bedroom because he does not know how to act but it's really because the girl doll that's a lavish she's been bleeding a little bit and we're not sure why but i feel like she's kind of in heat and since louie is only two he's about to be three on the 21st he's still kind of a like a baby so he's just in like he's just horny like horny so anytime he comes around and starts sniffing he's literally peeing everywhere and i'm sick of it so he's upstairs separate by himself he's good up there so once they leave they leave monday um and then we can kind of put him and june together so they can like because they already been around each other for the most part but since my since louis is just in horny mode he's like just peeing no matter what doll he's around so yeah we have to like put them together we probably do that sometime next week but for right now june is doing really good he is pooping a lot so we kind of he is only four months so we have to like take him out like probably like every two hours or something like that but he pooped in the house this morning y'all like a whole lot and i had to clean it up because my boyfriend wasn't here then i took him out he pooped some more and then my boyfriend came home at like 10 30 and he took him out for he took a whole walk and he pooped again so i'm like so i'm like what in the world like he's a very poopy boy but i think it may be his food right now we're using the food that the breeder gave him but i'm going to put him on propane just like louie so once that food is gone i mean it's really gone if you think about it it's really gone but we're going to get him some propane so we might either got to leave the house at probably like 4 30 ish at the latest five to go to the birthday party um so we might once he finished because he's working on his bike right now so once he's finished working on his bike we might go ahead and go to pet smart to go ahead and get him some more dog food and also get louis some dog food because it's time for him to get some too and i want to get him like a container for his dog food because i don't keep louis dog food in the bag i put it in a container and i just scoop it out the container because it kind of keeps the dog food fresh so i need to get june one as well and then i need to get him a mat to go under his bowl because if you guys know bulldogs are very messy and when they drink water or whatever their face it kind of drips from their face like slobber and water whatever it is so we need to get him a mat because hopefully we're going to teach him to like eat and drink at his um at his bowl but if it falls anywhere it'll be on the mat so that way it won't be all over the floor because right now it's just literally all over the floor um and i think that's it because he has a bed let me show you are his two beds these are the beds that my dad bought him so this is one and then this is the other one so he don't need a bed and i also have something else Hold up. i also have this bed right here that i got for louis because got that big bed y'all i'm kind of don't mind my camera settings i kind of been playing with it so it's kind of like wonky right now but that bed that's right there on the floor i got that bed for louis a long time ago because if you guys remember me telling you guys louis likes to hump a lot so anytime we got him like thick beds like i just showed you that june have downstairs he will hump them tear him up chew on him whatever so that's how i can even get him like stuffed animal toys because he literally he literally turns them up so instead of getting him a bed like that i got him this bed but he doesn't even use it and i did get the biggest size because i like for i like for my dogs to be very very comfortable as comfortable as they can be as if they was a human being like me so yeah so june has three beds so he don't need a bed he just need a mat 
food and a container for his food and i actually i think i got this bed from like five and below this is the only little bed that i let louis like lay on i keep it like in his crate whenever we're gone so he can lay on the other net he lay around the house but when he's in his crate this is what he lay on because he can't home this it's too flat <laughs> but yeah y'all that's the little update the girl is looking crazy like crazy crazy um, i'm gonna show you guys june real quick and then I'll talk to you guys later, like when I'm getting ready. I'm not gonna do like my makeup on camera or anything, but I'm gonna just show you guys like what I'm wearing and stuff before we get ready to leave the house. I might take you guys with us with us to pet some more. I don't know yet. But for the most part, if I don't take you guys with me with us to pet some more, if we go today, because we might not even go today, we might just go tomorrow. Cause he do have like one more um feeding that can last him until today because we're only trying to feed him twice a day because he's pooping too much and my dad was only feeding him twice a day because he's only 20 pounds he's only four months so he don't need that much food um so yeah i don't know we'll see but if not i'll just come up with you guys once i'm getting ready for the party tonight and then yeah so let me show you guys june say hey to the bar say hey Look, come here, buddy. Come here. Huh? June, come here. Come here, buddy. Hello. Say, I don't want to be out here with you. I want to be in the house. Look at his, look at my hand. We are dressed and we were supposed to go to PetSmart but we ran out of time but now we are about to hit the road and this is the outfit. Still waiting on Isaac to come downstairs. I put some brown on my lips. And yep. Try to do a knot. I try to do a knot bun but whatever. So yeah, this is the look.
I bought some baby wipes. That's the what's the I just need a mason jar type jar. Kind of the one that looked like Kata. I mean, on um, Louis. This is how much? It's all. I know. No, it's not. That look, yeah, that's how much. I mean, it's his size. What look like? Right yeah, I was about to say, and I can get the one like Louis. I want to see what kind they have. I need a, we need a big one though. I think. I don't know. We're gonna have to see how how much. Right. That's what I'm saying. We need to. But I'm talking about. So do you think we'll need that big one right there? We just don't have a big bag of food in. Which one you gonna get? I think the one that you need. No, that's the one that I was talking about. But that ain't the one that you want. So I was wondering if they even had it. Reserve your free visit at PetSmart.com. gang um it is hope it's focusing it is <coughs> my voice my voice so like i've been screaming and talking all week slash weekend but it is tuesday it's actually 5 38 don't mind what your girl got on i know i look a mess i literally just put on this barbie shirt and some shorts real quick i just got off work i got home at like five o'clock i got off at four i had to stop by some stores um, I just came home, changed real quick so I can take the dogs out because my boyfriend had to go into the office today. So he hasn't made it home yet. So I had to take both dogs out. Um, the dogs that was here, they are gone. They left last night. So we haven't been hearing too much of a barking, too much of barking. But June, he has been barking just a little bit. He's been barking just a little bit, but it's only when he's in his cage. If he's not in his cage, then he's good. Like right now, he's literally following me everywhere I go. Say hey, buddy. Do you want to say hey to the vlog? Say hey to the vlog, buddy. Give me, give me a paw. Give me that paw. Sit. Sit. Good boy. That's a good boy, buddy. That's your good boy. Um, actually, let me get him a treat. Because he did just sit. So we've been trying to teach him how to sit. And it's not really that he need to be taught how to sit. It's just he's stubborn. He's very stubborn. His treats over there. Sit. Can you do it one more time? It's okay. It's okay. Since you did it. But um yeah he's very stubborn my dad did tell us that bulldogs are very stubborn the older that they get but y'all he's only four months and he's very stubborn he can he know how to sit he know how to give paw but he only does it when he wants to y'all my forehead look huge but he only does it when he wants to but i think the last time i talked to you guys we went to pet smart and that was let me put some hands on because them treats freaking stink um we was at PetSmart. So we went to PetSmart Sunday. So I haven't talked to you guys since. Well, I haven't picked up my camera since Sunday. It's Tuesday. But um, I'm really just about to close this vlog out. We did. Um, we went to Target. I mean, we went to PetSmart. We got both of the dogs some food. We They're both. Because Louie, he's been on ProPlane. If you guys know about the... Um, the Yorkie, it's got like a Yorkie on the bag, but it was for the puppy under one. But since he is well over one, he's about to be three this month. I decided to just go ahead and up his um dog food. It's still like the same price, same size, everything. It's just for adult dogs and rather than um 
puppies that's under one years old. So I currently up that up. He's been eating it as normal. I feel like it tastes and looks, it smells the same. I just, I'm just hoping it doesn't like make him gain extra weight because I like the weight that he's at. He's like five and a half pounds. I don't really want him to get heavy. I want him to stay, you know, a good size, stay fit, stay, you know, energetic. But I just want him to be able to run around and stuff. I don't want him to be fat and lazy. Just like with June, he's 20 pounds right now. The biggest average size, average size for a bulldog is 50 pounds. So me and Ozzy is going to try to like, you know, watch his weight. We don't want him to really get over 50 pounds. We want him to stay active. We want him to stay strong, slim, all that good stuff. Right now, he's pretty good. He is heavy, don't get me wrong. But for the most part, he's very playful. He can run around and do whatever. Um, so yeah, we're super excited, y'all. We've been potty training him. He's been doing so good, but we still had to get a cage because we was kind of keeping him in the bathroom since we had those other dolls here. And we put we try to put him in that crate that's over there. It gets real big, but it's over there right now because he likes to go upstairs. Um, we try to put him in that, but he literally moved the whole thing around the house downstairs because we haven't really been trying to keep him upstairs too much like sleeping wise on the carpet because he is um he's very good with like puppy pads but once he pee on it he like like scoop them out the way and then if he has to pee again he'll just pee so we kind of just you know decided to get a cage um put some puppy pads in there and he still use them he's very good with puppy pads and then he'll just scoop them out the way for the most part he hasn't been peeing too too much since he's been in the cage what are you playing with Y'all, he's literally playing with his leash and his toys over there for him to play with, but he want to play with his leash. Y'all, I'm lighting this candle and it smells so freaking good, y'all. If you haven't, I already know everybody know about this candle, but it smells so freaking good, y'all. Like, it's smelling so good. June, what you doing, boy? Look at him, y'all. Anyways, I ain't trying to extend this little talk, but yeah, y'all. So that's like a little update. We got him a cage. We got them dog food. Wish my camera would focus. We got, I don't know why I just look so tan. Like, I don't know what I did to my camera. I don't know what I did. When I went home for Thanksgiving, I was kind of playing around with the knobs because I was trying to take like pictures on my camera to see how it worked, y'all. And I'm not feeling how my camera is looking now since I'm vlogging. But anyway, so yeah, we got him a cage. We got both of them some dog food. I um, We got him some treats, but we took them out of the bag. We put them in this. I like using containers when it comes to their stuff. I don't like to have that open and close little zip thing. No, I'd rather just take it out and put it in a container. And speaking of containers, yesterday... I got because we've been had this so we haven't really used it yet I might put some more trips in there I don't know but this is going to be June food and we put a measuring cup because we're trying not to feed him over half so we put that in there um this is Louis food and he also has like another one like halfway but it's upstairs because we kind of keep his food upstairs with his bowl with his bowls um but it's kind of halfway and we also keep like a measuring cup in his and then this right here just another container with just some treats and then we had to get some diapers because louis yeah he keeps peeing i don't know what's going on but he keeps peeing so until he stops peeing when he's trying to talk or when he's trying to play with june he's gonna keep that on i kept i put the coconut oil down here because now we need this for june's nose in case you know it gets a little too hard we have to wipe it and then my dad gave us this this is for his um for his eyes you know in case he gets like any of those things or whatever like how it turns brown since his face is very light we want to keep it clean so yeah this is like their cabinet don't this is just it don't matter but this is kind of like their cabinet their little area this is louis shirt i don't know what to do with that some um baby wipes for him and then of course we still have these for their um paws or whatever um, all right, yeah, and this is his cage. Since the other dolls was like right here, we kind of just put his cage right here in the corner because he keeps, he barks a lot when we're not home. So since he continues to bark and bark and bark while we're not home, we decided to put it like over here on this wall because we have neighbors, well, we have neighbors on both sides, but I feel like 
she's hardly ever home on this side and then on this side they're like always home so we decided to kind of like put it over here i don't really know if it makes a difference or not honestly but we tried and then this side, this is the bows that my dad got him but i tried to i saw this mat yesterday when i bought the little container for the food and clearly it's too small <laughs> so i think i'm going to keep it and just let louie use it for now but i'm going to get him a bigger one i don't want to play we have his bed right here the other one that i showed you guys is upstairs his tooth was kind of bleeding a little bit when he was playing with the toys so i had to wash that bed now it's clean but his other toys that he had but his other toys that he had um kind of had got blood on them so i had to wash that as well it's actually in the dryer right now and also when we went to well, when i went to work monday my boyfriend was working from home he had june out upstairs and he put his blue bed up there but he kind of peed on it just a little bit so i had to wash that today because i did like a lot of cleaning once the dogs left last night when i came home on my lunch break today i started doing some cleaning and i put it in the washer so when i got home after work i could put it in the dryer so now it's dry once they dry we're going to put that just back upstairs we're going to keep that upstairs um but yeah y'all that's like the little update for june so yeah he's a part of the family now and we love it we love it he's a very good boy we just have to get him body trained other than that he's a really really good boy um we're just trying to get him and louie to like become besties i mean it's not really june it's louis because louis just wants to hump and lick and suck and it's just getting out of control y'all so i don't really know what to do honestly i'm just gonna we're just gonna keep keep trying stuff you know probably gotta beat it out of them but i don't know <laughs> i don't know we'll see but y'all that's it for this vlog i'm just gonna go ahead and close it here because your girl is hungry i'm ready to shower and eats and all that good stuff probably pour me a glass of wine this candle is smelling good i am going to sit downstairs and then when my boyfriend comes i'm pretty sure we're just going to sit downstairs because we kind of just want june to kind of like get the feel of like kind of stand out just a little bit we don't want to just keep him in a cage the whole time we might bring louie back down you know after we eat and stuff so i don't know we'll see when my boyfriend get here but yeah y'all so thank you guys so much for watching this vlog i'm super super excited you guys got to meet june you guys will be seeing a lot more of him in the vlogs um and yeah thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys make sure you like comment and subscribe make sure you turn on those post notifications because what your girl pandora i'll be back with more love you guys bye